Hi, my name is Brian McLean. I'm an instructor of JavaScript and Python programming at Noble Desktop in New York City. In this video and in the ensuing couple of videos, we're going to look at how to build a movie database display. So we have a set of movies and what we want to do is load them up into the browser and have them sortable. So here they come in alphabetized by name, but we can also sort them by duration and by year. But in this first video, we just want to attend to one detail. We're going to add a new property to our array of movies so that we don't have to display the total raw number of minutes. If you look over at IMDb, here's Black Panther at 2H14M. That's the format we want. We don't really want it to say 134 minutes. And the reason it's doing that is because that's what our data set has. We've got an array of objects and there's a property called mins, and that's where we're drawing that information from. We also have name and year. So the first thing we want to do, we're going to implement that fix. So we're going to set up a loop through that movies array. So we're going to say for let i equals zero, i is less than movies dot length. That's that big array of objects you just saw, i plus plus. And every time through, what do we want to do? We want to grab the move, the mins property. So we're going to say let mins equal movies i dot min and then we're going to get the hours out of that by dividing mins by 60 and rounding that down so we'll say let hours equal mins divided by 60 and to round all that down we'll wrap it in math dot floor which returns the it takes whatever's in the parentheses and rounds it down and then we're going to use the modulus operator, which goes between two numbers and returns the remainder of the first divided by the second to get the remainder of minutes. So we'll say let rem mins, remainder minutes, equal mins mod 60. So in the case of Black Panther, that'll give you a 14. And then we're going to add a new key to our movies object. We're going to say movies i dot our min, we'll call it, equals, and we'll use string interpolation to just say hours followed by an h space remainder mins followed by a min uh, a m and that should do it so this is on a loop right so every time through the loop we'll get a new property called our min so let's log all that array of objects to the console to see if we do have that new our min property come over to the console we have an array and there it is there's a new property whoa and we have a bug because I put the dollar sign inside the parentheses instead of outside. So we'll fix that real quick. Yep. Back, refresh, open, and we're all good. And Black Panther is now 2H14M. So stay tuned for the next video where we render everything. And then the video after that, we're gonna implement the sort. In the meantime, till then, Thank you very much. Once again, I'm Brian McLean with Noble Desktop in New York City. Bye-bye.